Hi everyone, today we're going to take a look at the song Strangers by Bring Me The Horizon on acoustic guitar. We are in standard tuning and we have a capo on the first fret because when we have a capo we can play these very nice open chords. Okay, so the first one is a D minor. So 5 on the A string, 7 on the D string, 7 on the B string. 7 on the G string, sorry, 6 on the B string and the open E string. That's D minor. Then we have an F. You can play the open string too. And you have 8 on the A string, 10 on the D string, 10 on the G string, and then the open B and E string, or with the open string. So D minor, F, then, very nice, this is a B flat chord, it's uh, 6 on the low E string, 8 on the A string, 8 on the D string, and 7 on the G string. And again, the open B and E string. D, F, B flat, and then we have a G. We can play it here. I'll show you an, an, an alternative <laughs> in a second. We have 10 on the A string, 12 on the D string, 12 on the G string, and then again open B and E string. I like, instead of playing this chord, to play this one. I play it like this, you have 5 on the A string, 5 on the D string, and 3 on the G string. Open B and E string again. Very nice open chord. If you have a western guitar or very large hands, you can use your thumb to play the root note, 3rd fret on the E string. I can't do that. Can't do that on this guitar. So this is how I would play uh, the song. This is the verse and also the chorus. Yeah, you can alternate or play whatever you prefer. And uh, yeah, the chorus is the same. With a room full of strangers, okay, so that's most of the song. We have um, a bridge before the final chorus. Goes like this B flat to a C, which is the same shape, just one step up. To a D minor, to the F. We play that twice. We have that SOS part, and then we just go. We're just a room full of strangers, and so on. So, this is the B flat on the SOS part, and from there we go back to the chorus of that song. Yeah, and this is how to play Strangers by Bring Me the Horizon. Uh, very curious for the new album. I really enjoyed their last EP. This one is different, but still 
a very nice song. It gives me kind of nostalgia for the time where I listened to bands such as Rise Against. They had the song uh, Paper Wings that the song kind of reminded me of because of the open sounding, sounding chords. Yeah, I'm curious. If it's as good as the last one, then it's going to be very good. Okay, thanks for watching and see you next time.